tool and die itself, that's uh, it's a very large umbrella. A lot of things fit underneath that. Um, in tool and die, pretty much everything we look at is made somehow by a machinist or a toolmaker. I enjoy the creative side the most. You can show me a product and we can make it. Anything you can dream a tool and die team can build. I love that like I learn new stuff every day here and in the trade. I highly encourage anybody who has that that hands-on, they, they want to get in there and build something to check this out. It is it truly, um, this might be the right fit for you. At WCTC, we have a lot of equipment here and throughout the course of our education, we learn how to use it in a very practical way. We're, it's exactly what we're gonna be doing out in the field. At WCTC, I learned time management from the tool and die program, programming and programming concepts, as well as interpersonal communication skills. Uh, having good math skills is definitely a huge assistance and um, being interested in computers. So most of our students, if they want the jobs, they will have a job in the industry while they're going to school. Uh, the second year programs really dive deep into what you're doing in tool and die and the first year get you really ready for the second year classes. Machine tool operation is probably the class that's prepared me the most for my work in the field because that's really where they teach you the basics that you're going to need to know. How to use all the measuring tools, the procedure in the shop, how things work. In the second year of the tool and die program, students focus on plastic injection mold making and metal stamping dies. So students are required to build to, uh, plastic injection mold and stamping dies as a finished kind of capstone project. The final year of the program, the tool and die between mold making and stamping gives you the best education you can have when you step out into the field. Now the standard pathway that most people follow if they get a degree is they go out and they start looking for an apprenticeship. But an apprenticeship is a big investment on the company's part as well as on yours. And they don't like to take chances. So having that to your degree, like I said before, it's sort of a mark of credibility. And it really helps open that door up further for you because they'll be a lot more willing to entertain the idea of you taking you on as an apprentice. Um, our main goal of our program here is to lead you into an apprenticeship. Um, so you go through our two-year program, then you work through an apprenticeship, um, and then kind of that's where it's at. That's where you get the, the quality jobs and um, you have a, a very secure um, career ahead of you at that point. When uh, my high school said that they had like a dual enrollment program, I went and toured around, saw what programs were available, and when he showed me through the shop and showed me the lays and mills, like it just seemed interesting to me how you could take something so simple and make it like extraordinary. All the instructors here know what they're talking about. They've worked in industry for most of their life and now are sending the knowledge on to the future generations. They're all kind, but they want you to do well. Uh, I love WCTC and especially the tool and die program here. It's being in the industry now for about five years, it's the greatest place to learn and you learn everything from the beginning to the end. And it's a great stepping stone for getting into industry.